Praise the Lord. My name is Evangelist Anita L. Hewitt. I'd like to welcome you to the Hewitt Channel. It is midday. It's 11 o'clock a.m. on this time. Hallelujah. Pacific Standard Time. And I would like to welcome you. Praise the Lord. This is food for your soul. This is spiritual food that we need daily. Hallelujah. The Lord has been blessing me all day today. He woke me up this morning and saw another day. He gave me new mercies that I didn't deserve, but great is his faithfulness where he gives us new mercies daily. Hallelujah. And I give him the praise. Hallelujah. There is this song that's in my spirit, and I just want to share it with my brothers and sisters. It is called, There is None Like You. If you know it, you can sing it along with me, but it's just in my spirit. I just feel praise the Lord, praising God through song this morning as we start our lesson. Hallelujah. There is none like you. No one else can touch my heart like you do. I have searched for eternity long and find there is none like you. Sing it one more time. There is none like you. No one else can touch my heart like you do. I have searched for eternity long and find there is none. There is none. There is none like you. If you believe it, sing it with me one more time. There is none like you. No one else can touch my heart like you do. I have searched for eternity long and find there is none. There is none. There is none like you. I love you, Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah, Lord. I worship you, God, for there's none like you, Lord. I give you the praise and glory, Lord. I worship you, Lord. I glorify you, God, for there's none like you, Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 Lord. I worship you, God. I give you the praise and glory, Lord. For there's none like you, Jesus. There's none like you, God. I worship you, Lord. Let's go before the throne. Most gracious Father, we come before you right now, Lord, in the matchless name of Jesus. Father God, we thank you and praise you, Father God, for letting us see another day that we never seen before. Father God, we thank you for great is thy faithfulness, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord Jesus. You said, acknowledge me in all thy ways, and you shall direct our path. Father God, I thank you that our path is directed by you today, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Father God, we just love you. We praise you, Lord. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for your forgiveness. Lord Jesus, you've forgiven me from all of my sins. Lord Jesus, you said even though my sins may be as scarlet, as crimson, Father God, you will wash them whiter than snow. And Father God, I thank you, Lord Jesus, for being washed. Father God, forgive me for all of my sins, knowing and unknown sins, right now, Lord, in the matchless name of Jesus. And Father God, I just thank you for every blessing you have for us this day. Lord, in the name of Jesus, and Father God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for covering our children up under the blood of Jesus. Cover our grandchildren, Lord Jesus, that there is no weapon formed against us shall prosper. And every tongue that rises up against us shall be judged, for that is the for this is the inheritance we have in Christ Jesus. And Father God, we thank you. And we praise you for every blessing you have for us this day in the name of Jesus. 
amen and amen praise the lord again praise the lord i would like to thank you for tuning in to the hewitt channel you're in for a blessing today the lord has really been blessing me blessing us my husband and i as we go forth sharing the word of god hallelujah god is so worthy to be praised and hallelujah the bible says lift up your voice like a horn and praise his name so we're praising his name today hallelujah and today is just friday and it's you know some people say thank god it's friday but i thank god for every day for truly this is the day the lord has made we will rejoice and be glad in it today my topic today is an attitude of gratitude meaning that i am thankful for everything you've done in my life god i want to thank you for everything when we look back on our lives doesn't mean we want to go back to where god has brought us out of but when we look back and see how the enemy wanted to kill our lives from birth even hallelujah up until this present time but god had had his angels encamped around about us protecting us from seen and unseen danger and for that we say thank you jesus glory to god hallelujah so hallelujah you can't help but not to have an attitude of gratitude god i'm grateful hallelujah i want to be like hallelujah when god healed the 10 leopard boys and one came back just to say thank you i want to be that one that will come back and say thank you father thank you lord jesus for you're the lord of lords and the king of kings hallelujah you are my jehovah jireh you're my provider hallelujah you're my adonai let me tell you what adonai means adonai means that he is he that the lord is my master and the master's job is to take care of the servant so the servant doesn't have to want for nothing because the servant is faithful to his master so the lord is my adonai hallelujah and i thank god for him taking care of me because i have no wants in christ jesus because every need is already met in him and for that i just want to say thank you hallelujah you can't help like i said you can't help but not to have an attitude of gratitude so I just want to praise him today. I feel a praising in my spirit. And I woke up this morning just praising God, dancing all over the house today. Me and my husband, we were just sh shouting and praising the Lord. My husband, Pastor Brian Hewitt, he's anointed man of God, and I bless God for him. Hallelujah. And we got up this morning and just started praising God for every blessing that he has in our lives and what he's going to do for the promises of God in him are yea and amen hallelujah so we just thank God for God's promises we thank God hallelujah God said he inhabits the praises of his saints hallelujah God loves for his children to boast in the Lord hallelujah I'm not boasting in Anita Hewitt I'm boasting in the Lord hallelujah because God has done it God has done it. we all have a but God ministry just when our back was against the wall but God stepped in just when I thought I was going down for the last time but God came and reached and pulled me up and out of the the miry murk dirt and set me upon a rock hallelujah but God brought me out of darkness into the marvelous light hallelujah so we all have a but God ministry just when the doctor said that that just when the doctor said that there's no hope hallelujah but our hope is in christ jesus hallelujah god done that thing but god hallelujah so therefore i have an attitude of gratitude today hallelujah i make no apologies for me praising the lord because he's worthy to be praised glory to god hallelujah i just want to say hallelujah thank you jesus glory to god because he's worthy because he's so worthy he's so worthy hallelujah i can't say he's good you know how you say god is good all the time god is good yes hallelujah he is that but he's so much much more my question to you hallelujah yeah he's good but what is he to you hallelujah he is my adult nine he's my will 
angel, hallelujah, in the middle of the wheel. He is my morning star, hallelujah. He wakes me up with the finger of love, hallelujah. He wipes my tears in the midnight hour. He rocks me in the midnight, hallelujah. He rocks me to sleep, glory to God, hallelujah. He takes away the pain in my heart, hallelujah. He heals my body, hallelujah, hallelujah, because he's Jehovah Rapha, hallelujah. So he's so much more than he's good, hallelujah. Mm -mm -mm. Hallelujah, he's more than that. Hallelujah, our finite mind can't even conceive what we can say, how good he is. God is excellent. Hallelujah, God is awesome. Hallelujah, we serve an awesome Savior. Glory to God. So, hallelujah, I have an attitude of gratitude today. I have an attitude of gratitude because he's so worthy. He's so worthy. Glory to God. I can't help but not to raise my hands and say, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. Glory to God, because he's worthy, because he's so, so, so worthy. Hallelujah, like my grandson said when he says when it's good. Mm -mm -mm. It's so, 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 so good. God is so, 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 mm -mm -mm. hallelujah, God will make me sing that. The Campbell Soup song, mm -mm, good. God is more than that. Hallelujah. He's even better than that. Glory to God. Hallelujah. So I love it. I love God. I love to praise the Lord. Glory to God. We're going to go before the Lord. We're coming out of Isaiah 12, verses 1 through 6. I'm reading from the King James Version. So you can follow with me or if you have your NIV or whatever um, version you have, Read along with me. Grab your Bibles. Hallelujah. Because the Word of God is the only thing that's going to keep you. Songs are wonderful. Hallelujah. Dancing is beautiful. Praising God is wonderful. But the Word of God is the only thing that's going to keep you when the enemy comes. Because we have to give the enemy back his word. Hallelujah. Give back the enemy, give the enemy Jesus' word. It's not my word, it's Jesus' word. So we can bind him because the Bible says the devil trembles just by saying the name of Jesus. Jesus! Hallelujah! I gave him a breakdown. I gave him a nervous breakdown. Hallelujah! With the praises and praising God, he had a nervous breakdown. Hallelujah! So he's leaving the Hewitt family alone today. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And as you praise him, he will have a nervous breakdown and he'll leave you alone as well. Hallelujah. But we're going to go into the message today. Again, the title is An Attitude of Gratitude coming out of Isaiah 12 verses 1 through 6. And in that day, thou will say, O Lord, I will praise thee. Thou was angry with me, thine anger has turned away, and thou has comforted me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I love it because I want to break down the word. I want to let you know that, hallelujah, God says anger, but sin not. But see, when God, see, I love it because God is so merciful. Even when we do things wrong, hallelujah, God just extends the loving. He, God says, with love and kindness have I drawn thee. So he's still drawing us with love and kindness. So even though that maybe we might have upset God, maybe we done something that 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 please that wasn't pleasing in God's sight but his anger has turned and he's comforted me and how he comforts me is that he he gently rocks me and says no Anita come this way Anita repent come back to me hallelujah he says with love and kindness have I drawn thee and I thank God that God draws us with his loving with bands of love he he draws us hallelujah closer to him behold God is my salvation I will trust and not be afraid for the Lord Jehovah is my strength and he is my song. He's also become my salvation, meaning that hallelujah, Jehovah meaning God, he is my God. He is my personal savior. See, hallelujah, you got to have a personal relationship with the Lord. Hallelujah. I don't have religion. I have a personal relationship with Jesus because religion fails. Re religion comes and goes. But when you have a personal relationship with the Lord, the Lord has become my salvation, meaning that it's personal. He is my personal savior. He is my father. He is my he is my everything. Hallelujah. I cannot do nothing without God. So hallelujah. Because of that, I have a personal relationship. So he has become my salvation. Hallelujah. He says, therefore, with joy shall we draw waters 
out of the wells of salvation. Out of your belly shall flow rivers of living water. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When you just have a hallelujah in your spirit. Sometimes, hallelujah, you'll be walking around the house and you just hear a song in your spirit and you're just humming along and you're hymning along and you're singing and you're rocking and there's no music around and people are looking at you crazy. But hallelujah, it's out of my belly shall flow rivers of living water. And hallelujah, in my belly, I'm praising God. I hear a hallelujah in my spirit. I hear a praise the Lord in my spirit. Hallelujah. And he's so worthy. So out of your hallelujah. So he says, therefore, with joy shall you draw waters out of the wells of salvation. Verse 4. And in that day, ye shall say, praise the Lord. Call upon his name. Declare his doings among his people make mention that his name is exalted meaning wherever i go i'm going to praise him wherever i go hallelujah if i'm in the storehouse i'm going to praise him if i'm in the bus i'm going to praise him if i'm in a car i'm going to praise him if i'm in a taxi wherever i am it doesn't have to be behind a pulpit it doesn't have to be in front of the internet that i am right now but hallelujah wherever i go hallelujah i'm going to praise him i'm going to make mention of his doings hallelujah i'm going to exalt his name because there's nothing good of evangelist anita but what makes me righteous is christ jesus hallelujah because god says your your righteousness has filthy rags but what makes me righteous what makes me holy what makes me righteous is the spirit of god because god is righteous and because of that i'm righteous in christ jesus without without him i'm nothing glory to god but i'm praising god wherever i go I'm exalting his name. He says, sing unto, sing unto the Lord, for he has done excellent things that this is known in all the earth. Sing unto the Lord. Hallelujah. God said, I inhabit the praises of your saints. He says, he says sing unto me a new song. Hallelujah. God says, hallelujah. Mm -mm -mm. I love to praise him. He said, praise he, O ye saints. Sing unto me a new song. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with thanksgiving. Hallelujah. And know that he is Lord. Hallelujah. That's Psalms 100. Glory to God. But hallelujah. But you, you sing unto the Lord a new song. Hallelujah. God said, I inhabit the praises. God loves for us to sing praises of God's excellent works upon the earth hallelujah god wants us to exalt his name because he is so worthy he is so worthy to be praised glory to god so i just want to praise him because he's so worthy glory to god so in verse five he says sing unto the lord for he has done excellent things hallelujah this is known in all the earth verse six cry out and shout thou inhabitants of zion for great is the holy one of israel in the midst of thee glory to god hallelujah great is the lord hallelujah hallelujah we are the chosen one we are royal priesthood we are peculiar people we are called by god hallelujah we are we are queens and prince we are because hallelujah our father is the king hallelujah so we are joint heirs to the throne glory to god know who you are in christ jesus hallelujah one of my favorite scriptures is coming out of psalms 139 14 i'm fearfully and wonderfully made marvelous are thy works and thou so knoweth right well meaning that i know who i am in christ jesus i'm fearfully and wonderfully made marvelous are thy works and my soul knoweth with right well so if anyone asks you how you're doing you say i'm marvelous darling i'm marvelous why because god said i'm marvelous i'm wonderfully and skillfully made marvelous are thy works so i'm marvelous darling how are you i'm marvelous i'm marvelous in christ jesus glory to god hallelujah so i love to praise him because he is so worthy to be praised glory to god hallelujah so we have an attitude of gratitude because he is worthy because he is so worthy here are some here's just some scriptures i want to give you write down out write it down on your leisure i'm coming out of psalms 9 and 11 sing unto the lord 
who dwells in Zion declare among his people his deeds. In other words, I'm going to shout out. I'm going to tell everyone about the goodness of God. Wherever I go, hallelujah, God said, if you don't praise me, I'll have the rocks cry out to praise me. And trust me, there will be no rock that will be crying out louder than me. I'm lifting up the name of Jesus because he's worthy to be praised. Psalms 33 and 11, he says, Bless, Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. The people who he has chosen of his own inheritance we are his own inheritance and we are blessed hallelujah so we live on this earth but we're not part of this earth but god created this earth what for his saints for his children we are joint heirs to the throne so we have the best of everything we don't have to want for anything because our heavenly father takes care of all of our needs why because he's jehovah jireh he's the god that provides glory to god in psalms Hallelujah, 51, 15. He says, O oh Lord, open my lips that, that my mouth may declare his praises. In other words, wherever I go, I'm going to shout out. I don't care where I am. I don't care if you want to hear it or not. I'm praising my God because I'm not ashamed. The Bible says if you're ashamed of me before men, I'll be ashamed of you before my Father, which is in heaven. And hallelujah, I am not ashamed to declare the glory of God. I'm not ashamed to praise him because he's so worthy to be praised. Hallelujah, because if it wasn't for the grace of God, I would not be here. If it wasn't for his mercy, I would not be here. If it wasn't for his love and kindness, I will not be here. Hallelujah. So I'm praising God wherever I go. Hallelujah. I know what God has done. God has healed me. Hallelujah. I fell three feet down in the elevator shaft, broke my whole left side, my kneecap, elbow, and injured my spine. And doctors said I'll never walk at the rightful age of 27. But God, I'm 52 years old, looking good, loving God, still walking and praising God, has not stopped me for one second, yet I'm still magnifying God because he's worthy to be praised. So I know him, so I will not be quiet. I will magnify God. I have an attitude of gratitude because I'm grateful for what God has done in my life. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Mm -mm -mm. Psalms 104, 33. I will sing to the Lord as long as I live. I will sing praises to my God while I have my being. In other words, I will praise God for the rest of my life. Until God calls me home, that's when I'm going to stop praising him. Short of that, honey, I'm going to be praising him every day, all day. Hallelujah. Every time you see me, every time. Hallelujah. 24 and 7. Hallelujah. Because he's so worthy to be praised. He is so worthy. God is worthy to be praised. Saints of the Most High God, lift up the name of Jesus because he's worthy. He is so worthy to be praised. Glory to God. I will praise him in the midst. I will praise him no matter what goes my what what comes and what and what goes. Hallelujah. I will praise him. Hallelujah. My husband had read Romans 8 38 nothing shall separate me from the love of God nothing nothing shall separate me from the love of God nothing nothing no famine no death no heights no depths nothing shall separate me from the love of God hallelujah Psalms 145 and 1 hallelujah I will exalt you I will exalt you my God O king I will bless you or I will bless your name forever and ever. I will lift you up, O oh God, O oh King, because I reverence you. You're my King of Kings and Lord of Lords. So Lord, I will exalt you. Exalt means to lift you up, to, to, to praise him. Hallelujah. And I will bless your name. Not now, not only when I'm in front of the camera, not only when I'm at church, not only when I'm uh, at Bible study, not only when I'm around the saints, I'm going to praise you 24 and 7. I'm going to praise you forever and ever, now and forever, because you're so worthy to be praised. I'm going to praise you because he's worthy. Hallelujah. And I want to encourage you to praise God. Hallelujah. You can praise your way out of out of out of 
out of diseases. You can praise your way out of debt. You can praise your way out of anger. Hallelujah. Because when you start praising God, anger has to go. Hallelujah. When God said, whose mind is stayed on him, that he'll keep you in perfect peace. So when you keep your mind on God, hallelujah, God will keep you in perfect peace. And hallelujah, that's why we have an attitude of gratitude. Yes, I have an attitude. The attitude is, the attitude is I'm magnifying God. My attitude is an attitude of gratefulness. My attitude is an attitude of thanksgiving. That's what gratitude means, to be grateful, to be thankful. Hallelujah. Because I'm thanking God for everything he's done in my life and what you're going to do in my life. Hallelujah. Why? Because you're worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. I'm not praising him just because I'm in front of the camera. I'm praising him because I love him. I have a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. He has become my salvation. He's become my personal salvation savior hallelujah and if you don't know the lord as your personal savior hallelujah now is the time to get it right because no man knows the day nor the hour when the son of man is coming and we want to be sitting right i don't want to be getting ready when he comes because if you're not ready god says if you're righteous still be righteous if you're filthy be filthy still so i want to be sitting ready i want to be active doing what god has called me to to do i want to be found when jesus called me home i want to be busy doing the will of god hallelujah according to romans 10 and 10 for with the heart man believeth unto self unto righteousness but with the mouth confession is made unto salvation in verse 13 of the same chapter romans 10 13 for whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And I want you to repeat this prayer. Repeat it after me. And hallelujah. You will, you will be blessed. You will be blessed. You will make the, the greatest step in your life. Hallelujah. Repeat after me. Dear God, I admit I'm a sinner and I need your forgiveness. I believe that Jesus died in my place for the penalty of my sins. I am willing right now to turn my sin and accept Jesus Christ as my personal Savior and Lord. I commit myself to you and ask you to send the Holy Spirit into my life to fill me and take full control and help me to become the person that you birthed me to, come, to become. And thank you, Father, for loving me in Jesus' name. If you said that prayer came from your heart, glory to God, hallelujah, God received it. And I want to welcome you into the body of Christ. You took the greatest step first. You accept Jesus Christ as your personal Savior. Now the second step, I want you to get into the Word of God. I want you to go to a Bible teaching church and I want you to get into the word not only go on Sunday but go on Bible study nights so you could learn the word of God and you'll be able to stand on his word and let's go before the Lord once again I want to thank you for tuning in and to the Hewitt channel Hallelujah. It's truly been a blessing. We are a ministry that's on the move. We just came back from Kenya and we plan to go back to Kenya. We're going to Nigeria. We're going to uh, Cape Town. We're going to Australia. We're going to the uttermost parts of the earth. And if you want a partnership and bless this ministry, come to our webpage at www.brianhewitt.com. And where you could click on the, don the, the donation sign. And you could also sign up for the email. And we will keep in touch with you via email. And I want to thank you again. My name is Evangelist Anita 
L. Hewitt. Let's go before the Lord. Most gracious Father, we thank you and praise you for a glorious time. Father God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for your spirit reigning and ruling in our lives. Father God, we thank you that we do have an attitude of gratitude today. Father God, I will forever praise you for you are worthy to be praised. Father God, we just love you and we praise you for every blessing you have for us this day, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Now, Father God, I ask you just to continue on to to, to continue on having your angels encamped around about us, Lord, as we go and finish the rest of this day, or if this is your evening, Father God, we thank you, Lord Jesus, for your divine protection. And Father God, we'll be careful to give you all the praise, all the glory in Jesus' name. Tune back in. I will be back on at 3 o'clock p.m. And also my husband, Pastor Brian Hewitt will be on at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. You're in for a blessing. Tune back in to the Hewitt channel. And we love you with the love of the Lord. May God bless you and keep you. Amen.